Hello everyone and welcome to a Let's Play of Heritage with your host in Validation X145. Um, yeah. I said I was going to be doing a couple other games. Um, just finished up Road Rash 64, so if you want to check that out, then go right ahead. But anyway, here I am with my first actual horror game. Um, this game is completely free. You're not going to find it out on the market, I don't think. Um, link for download will be in the description if I can find it. I downloaded this game a long time ago, and I'd really been wanting to do a Let's Play of it, but then I started Road Rash 64, and it's like, well, dunno. I'll just do it later then. Um, but yeah, so here it is, Heritage, and I thought I'd keep it as a little surprise for you guys. Um, this is going to be my very first horror game, and it's going to be blind, so I have no idea what's going on in the story. Um, I've been in the first five minutes of the game, just so I could get a feel for the mechanics and stuff. Um, as it turns out, all I know, well, actually I do know a little bit of the story, but not enough to really do anything with it. All I know is that you're playing as this girl, I think? Maybe? Maybe? Maybe not? I don't, I'm not really sure. All I really do know is that you are playing as a character, and you start off in your grandma's house, and your grandma's dead. So, yeah, that's it. So, let's go ahead and start a new game here. And, yeah. Why is that we always yearn childhood memories when we lost someone? Why those memories become painful nightmares when we, lose, when we lost someone? That is how I'm feeling. Yearning those beautiful moments lived in her house. A woman so wise. Wisdom that is only kept in my memory after she passed away three days ago. It's time to abandon these confusing thoughts and return to that place, her house. So full of memories and knowledge, questions. Perhaps I will finally find inner peace. And maybe a self spelling check because you spelled knowledge and painful wrong and beautiful but yeah whatever somebody's been crying like really bad that's that's a nasty mascara smear anyway here we are grandma's house washing machine Unlike other washing machines, this does not make much noise. How would you know that? It's not running anything. Oh, you're weird. Apparently you cannot move while you crouch. Interesting. Hey look, dishes. Apparently I can pick these up and a glass. I will take those and wash what was left. Because I can. Because I'm a good granddaughter. Or grandkid, I think. Got a kettle. Oven. When she cooked, I could smell the delicious smell of food. Food does smell delicious until you burn it. Countertop. Absolutely nothing. And that sink looks... Oh, okay. It's just... It's very deceptive. Doesn't look like it's... uh Hold it out until you do this, and then it, then it looks right. But you gotta do that first. Let's open this up. A pot. I'm not hungry nor desire to cook anything. Okay. A bin. Cool. Maybe that will come in handy. I need to throw stuff away anyway. Phone. Strange it doesn't work. And another glass. Compact stereo. It can play CDs and MP3, it has a radio too. Still, I'm not turning that on. Wonder why. I mean, it's always nice to listen to some music. You know, instead of this creepy background stuff. Ooh, that looks pretty out there. I'll have to check out the window first. Flashlight. Always good in a horror game. And some more glasses. Those are already clean, so I'm not going to be doing dishes. Uh, well, I'm not going to be washing those. Cutlery. Um, meh. That's all nice and clean. I'm not going to mess with it. Hey, refrigerator. I'm going to have to 
Oh. Somebody's already been in here. Already cleaned out our food supply. That was my job. That was in the will that I was to come and get all our food. A note from my grandma? I should read it. I copied the text to my notebook. This is very strange. Okay, notebook is N? Yes. Grandma's note. Beloved granddaughter. Yeah, okay. So I am a granddaughter. As you are reading this note, I'm dead by now. Please don't be... Uh, okay. Please don't be sad and pay attention to what is written in this note. I had discovered something beyond imagination, indescribable to your senses of your world. I left my will within notes and puzzles that will help you understand. Search the clock for a key. Uh... Then, what was that piece of paper I saw down at the lawyer's office? I thought that was... I thought that was your will. What? What is this? An old wooden clock seems to be broken. Okay. You examine the clock, you discovered a small piece of metal behind it. It's a key, and I take it. Cool. Tab's inventory. Why do I have all these plates? Suddenly I feel very strange. Yeah, why... <laughs> Um, I'm not sure why I'm carrying a bin all of a sudden. A nice yellowish flashlight, a normal glass, a small bronze key is for a jewelry box. I wonder, can I drop stuff? Ooh, I can... I... what? Weird. I loved making coffee in this red kettle. Okay, that's a very strange filter, but whatever. Oh, is my inventory full? Come on. I have a shadow. Alright, let's uh, check behind here. Um, ooh, a light. Ah, oh, that's bright. What the hell? Wow, that's laggy. And it looks horrible. It makes everything shiny. Beds aren't supposed to be shiny like that. TV! Pretty nice TV. I like to watch it while getting asleep. Where did you go to school, young lady? That is not how you used to talk. Ooh, jewelry box. I'll take that. Close my drawer. Grandma's photograph. Damn, she looks good for her 48th anniversary. I know my grandma didn't look like that when she was 70. Hoo -hoo. Hold on a second. Dark Smoke Studios, huh? Interesting. Let's check in here, just... Ooh. Nah, the boots weren't in... weren't for me or Will. Those were uh, for Cousin Mally. I never understood why the gay cowboys always liked the, liked the boots. It's actually kind of ironic if you think about it. I mean, gay cowboys, and yet they're known so well for being, um, what's the word? Lovers, I think. Well, pickuppers. Ooh, that is some nice grass. And this is on low, too. Kaluza Frame. Theodore Kaluza, she named him a few times along with Klein. Are these a scientists? It has to do with space dimensions. Huh. Weird. Why am I standing on the bed? That's a rude thing to do. I can see my feet. Very strange. Open this up. Oh. Master bathroom, probably. Close that. And another bin. Come here. Whoopsie. Now I am carrying two trash bins. I'm going to be getting a lot of garbage out of here. Whoa, that's uh, trippy. And not what I meant to do. Oh, oh, okay. I did not realize that. Use with um, this. Hmm, that doesn't work. This is going to be it. Whoa. Yo. 
There we go. A jewelry... Oh, interesting. A jewelry box has a small lock. Use with this. You open the jewelry box with a small bronze key. You found a note inside. Click to close. And use. Can't use it like that. Mm, that doesn't work. Eh. Use with. I have no idea. Exit. Um. Whoopsie. Wrong button. <laughs> ah! Stop it. Jewelry box note. Look at the clock. Hour will tell you the row number from below to above in minutes. What book to read from left to right. Remember on the shelf to the right in the first floor. What? That made absolutely no sense. Let's take a look outside. Ah, that refreshing sunset. Or maybe it's the sunrise. I don't know. The clock was broken, so I really don't know what time it is. This is a very small utilitarian backyard. I just took a shower before I got here, so I do not need to take one. Do I... Okay. Um, Grandpa did not have... any problems going to the bathroom before he died, so I don't know why this is here. Yeah, whatever. I don't know what the other houses on the block look like, so I'm not going to judge. Oh, whoa, 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 hold on. No, just more clothes. Okay. Why is there not a drawer in this one? It's weird. Huh. Very strange. Yeah, alrighty then. Uh... So something about... What did it say about the clock? Look at the clock. Hour will tell you the row number... Hour will tell you the row number from below to above. And minutes, what book to read from left to right. So, fourth row at the top. First book. Remember, on the shelf to the right in the first floor. Okay. So, where's a bookshelf? I need to look for a bookshelf. I have no idea where... Oh, wait a minute. I was going to look at the uh, outdoors first. It is dark all of a sudden. I don't remember it being this dark. Weird. Oh, well. Maybe we can go outside and have a... I just got here. I want to meditate the loss and remember the moments I spent with it. Never mind then. Um... What bookcase? It's set on the first floor, but I don't see any bookcases around here. Weird. Maybe... Uh... Oh! Maybe this bookcase? Leave? What? Uh... The hell kind of lock is that? That's weird. Goodbye. I have no idea. And why do you have bars on the back of the windows if your neighbor is right across and you trust them and there's a big wall between you? Uh, weird. Of course, if you don't trust your neighbor, then... Oh. But, wait a minute. These are books on the... Whoa, what's going on? There we go. Huh. Only been, what, five minutes and it's already getting glitchy? Oh, it's probably my fault. Oh, super bright and super laggy. Major frame rate drop. Okay. Theodore Kaluza books, huh? Physics book. Einstein books. Wow. My grandma must have been psychist. Weird. Novel books, Buddhism. 
my grandma must have been a really smart woman. A really smart woman. So, which bookcase? Because there's two of them. Look at the clock, hour, blah, 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 blah. Remember on the shelf to the right in the first floor. Okay, so it must be this one. So, fourth row, first book. Grandma was obsessed with how things work. This one. Chemistry. I remember when hated these chemis chemistry books. Grandma helped me a lot studying for chemistry at school. And I just accidentally opened my DVD thing. Great. So a lot of, ooh, geometry in space. Hmm, hypercube. Psych is the book, it's about conspiracies. Oh. Four volumes about world history. The mystery of the atom. Intriguing title. Wizard Battle Dome. What the hell is this? My grandmother used to read me these when I was just a little girl. Okay. Psychology. I guess these volumes explain our minds. Geography Atlas. Six volumes in total. That's five. Five? Nope. Six volumes. Okay. Uh, Buddhism. Astronomy. Really interesting books about the universe. Anatomy Encyclopedia. Boring. Novel books. Books I had never heard of. Eh, whatever. Wrong bookcases then. Open. What the fuck? Um. What the fuck just happened? Oh, yeah. And because it's a horror game, I'm probably going to be swearing a lot. That was a very strange sheet jumper. That wasn't that wasn't even scary, but the music was just like dun dun dun. It's like what the hell just happened, you know? It scared me a little bit. Wasn't the chair moving? That would have been perfectly normal in real life because I'm haunted. No, I'm not actually haunted, but that wouldn't have scared me in real life. But if that was but there wouldn't have been any music with it. That, the music was what scared the crap out of me. You know, music makes half the half the atmosphere in a game. You know that? I mean, if this if this music wasn't playing right now, it would not be creepy at all. You'd just be like, oh, I'm just wandering through the house. Oh, chair slid. That's weird. Keep walking. Laptop battery. So apparently, the mom had a lap. Uh, wow. Apparently, Grandma had a laptop somewhere. Weird, I wouldn't take her for a techie. Although she was, a, although she is a smart person, so maybe she did some research at the college or something. I don't know. <sighs> Whoa! This is a very empty bathroom. Very big bathroom, though. Where's the mirror? The, huh? Why are there no mirrors? And why is this a brick wall? That makes no sense. Hmm, this wall wasn't here the last time I visited my grandma. I thought that was weird. Interesting. Let's go downstairs. Find this bookcase, maybe. And I am curious. Go out into the garden, huh? There is grass coming through the wall. That is very bad. Grass in your house is not a good thing for hygiene. A wood floor. What is this? It's a wood floor. What do you... Ugh. What is this? Weird. I'm going to check out this... Uh, wood floor first. Oh, wait a minute, I forgot. I can't move when I'm crouched like that. And I'm not looking at it anymore for some reason. Uh, maybe I use something on it? No. Um. Okay, I used that already. Uh, 
am so confused. What do I do? Okay. Okay, so so far we've made absolutely no progress. Except for the fact that we got two notes. And that the jewelry box note refers to some weird bookcase that we have no idea where it is. And we've also found as the player, not the character, that our mother, grandmother, my bad, couldn't get that mixed up a lot, is very smart. And also, according to the first note, that she has something that allows her to experience amazing things. Maybe it's a vibrator, I don't know. See, but... Hold on. Look at the clock. Hour will tell you the row number from below to above in minutes. What book to read from left to right? Remember on the shelf to the right in the first floor. There's no bookshelf in the first floor. There's only a shelf here. I mean, there's only two bookshelves there. What the hell? Ah. Maybe... I have no idea. Okay, so fourth, fourth row, one over. It's all physics books. Then Theodore Kaluza. Einstein. She always claimed him as the greatest genius of all time. He was a genius. Still is. Apparently, um, they found something where Einstein actually proved himself wrong on something. I don't remember what it was. Oh, it was that EMC is... It's the uh, E equals MC squared equation. I think they said that Einstein proved himself wrong on that equation, that it doesn't actually work as a law. Or was that a theory equation? I don't even remember. What bookcase? What bookcase is she talking about? I'm so confused. But of course, one has to remember that the first floor is also very subjective. And I'm very curious about this wood floor. It's a wood floor, doofus. Can I lift it up or something? Maybe if I jump on it. Nah, it just looks weird. Maybe there's something in the grass that I'm missing. Like a tool or something? on it apparently okay I'm obviously missing something because I'm not making any other progress here maybe I have no idea a lock prevents me from opening the door what does this even do ah kind of figure that didn't work Okay, so let's reset that. Try. Of course, it didn't work. I don't know. You get the occasional person that sets it, so. You get the. What the oh, there we go. Ah, my foot. Ah, foot's asleep. 